Um, so, like, I don't know what exactly it is that 21 Savage is doing, but he has at least <laughs> told the world that he plans to put out a movie about his life, and it had a four-minute trailer to it where Donald Glover plays him when he's older and somebody I y'all have heard of that I haven't heard of plays him when he's younger. But anyway, I look up on the internet and people were talking about it and they sent a clip and it looked like it was like some version of Highly Questionable in there. And I was like, wow, what a random thing. And then I looked at it and was like, no, nah, they really try to, they really try to do Highly Questionable. And I was like, I had no idea that I had such an impact on the life of 21 Savage that not only would I be part of the movie, whatever the hell they doing about his life, but that I would make the trailer of the movie about his life, except the problem is, I don't know what I did to 21 Savage, Donald Glover. <laughs> like, I have no idea what I've done to offend yeah. these people. I met Donald Glover one time. It was with Pablo, and they was talking about Star Wars and shit, right? Like, <laughs> like, so we didn't talk very much. I don't feel like I was in a position to say anything that was offensive. I felt, I felt like his, his people treated me very well. But for whatever the reason, they they had your boy out there looking bad, dog. They 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 <laughs> they they had they 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 thought that I would get on TV without no jacket on, just with a shirt, a dress shirt with the undershirt out of it, the, the out the pack joint, the 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 the, the one the, the church one. You know what I'm saying? And I just don't know what I ever did to give them that implication. And never mind the fact my man Poppy had a Fu Manchu. I don't know how you say that in Spanish, but he had a Fu Manchu. <laughs> And then I was out there in a dingy undershirt under a mediocre dress shirt. And I don't know who I need to blame. It was like, like it, it didn't seem like it was meant to be. A, it was like in that gray area where it was like, they obviously not mean to insult you, but they didn't care enough to do you right. Like it was the only one that they <laughs> like dance. They kind of like, all right, they, I see y'all really went for it. Y'all put some they effort in there. It. It. They're like, we got a Dan. Like, we're going to make a caricature of Dan. And that's exactly what I would have imagined it looked like. And then the poppy one is like, it's like gradient. The poppy one's not <laughs> as good, but like, all right, it's an old version of that first guy. I get it. And then they got to you and they was like, hey, yo, on the lights. <laughs> Go ahead and drop that light. We need you real quick. Go sit down. <laughs> I saw somebody. I saw somebody. The things that people had to say about me. One of them said I look like some kind of like a great value version of Thomas Jones. One dude said, "What well, my look, and I think he nailed it with this one. He said, he's seen my look before. That's a man going to fight a speeding ticket. I was like, you damn right. It's <laughs> me versus City Hall, and I'm going to win one way or another. I just, like, it's so bad to the point where I actually kind of cool in that nobody would actually think it was me if yeah. it were not for the other cats being there at the same time. Oh, yeah, there's no way that people, if they just show you that picture alone, just that guy, it's no way that anybody thinks that's you. They just they they ran out of uh, casting budget by the time they got to the end of the table. But what's so wild about it is that interview, and I know he became a meme from it, but I never actually knew what the meme was. I just knew that people talked about it. We did a lot of interviews on Highly Questionable Rappers, and that one was maybe, I have nothing I remember from it. There was nothing memorable that came out of that one. But apparently it made a big deal to 21 Savage because I'm a part of his life story, baby. That's crazy. Yeah, it's shocking me. The only interview I remember from you on there, I mean, I remember a few of them, honestly, but when you guys discovered a rap mystery, that was fun. That was big. And also, I think you guys had Megan Good on one time, right? Yes, yeah, I, I remember that. I saw she she been in the news lately. Every time yeah, I see her, I think of my yeah. man. I got to say, the, the 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 new pity shine off of my my Megan Good moment is every every, every time that you know she corrected now, and so every time that uh, I just damn dog like that one right there. Sometimes you just I, I guess it's not supposed to be this way, right? But. Just a little less. I I can't tell if the issue is that I feel a little less special or that, man, I probably should have just gone for it. <laughs> I should have just gone ahead. Apparently, what? you can against against some odds. I know I know my shit was looking a lot smoother than what she dealing with right now. And she jumped into it when it was on fire. She ran into a burning building to save this man. <laughs> she is a fire. Now you got me imagining her at home with a backbone. <laughs> She, she, she yeah, showed up and went out there and took it. Came down the pole. 
She got an ax in one hand and a fire hose in another, boy. Prize Picks is the most fun you can have by winning up to 25 times your money this football season, and now you can play during basketball season two. You just select two or more players, pick more or less on their projected stats, and place your entry. Prize Picks is really simple to play. You can make your picks and submit your entry in less than 60 seconds. So make sure you go to prizepicks.com slash Bomani and use code Bomani for a first deposit match of up to $100. That's prizepicks.com slash Bomani. Prize Picks, daily fantasy sports made easy. 